Today, I come to you with a bit of a new video. Today, I want to tell a bit of a story. If you guys don't know, there has been something going around recently called the 200 pull series, where essentially a single user in Honkai Star Whale has been pulling five star light cones, but in heaps in droves in them. To be more specific, they have been pulling in the range of 200 S5 light cones of certain characters. And today, the series has ended and the person has decided to stop doing the 200 pull series. But first, before we talk about why they stopped, I want to talk a little bit about what this series was. So obviously, you guys can tell from the text that this person was a Chinese player. And most of the content that they made for this was on the Billy Billy platform under the name Adore Fusei. Now, that name's kind of important, and we'll get a little more into that later. But you can see that they have hour-long live streams here or videos on their Billy Billy channel of them pulling for 200 to 50, sometimes 100 copies of certain characters. For example, if we look at the Robin one here, you can see that these videos get an absurd amount of attention. I believe this is 20,000 likes, uh, a bunch of shares. People really enjoyed this stuff. Now, I apologize for the terrible quality of this video. I don't know if I can change that on here. I'm not familiar with Billy Billy, but essentially what he would do in these videos is he would pull, and if we skip to the end here, you can see that he has all the s5 robin light cones now this one was a lighter one and this one he only pulled 50 of them if you go to the more crazy one which i think as you go on and on with this it gets a little more crazy he starts out with 50 50 100 100 and then most recently he did the phase out 200 200 s5 light cones which was by far the biggest money sink i've ever seen in a gacha game to give a little context to how much money was spent on this individual video we can see at the top right hand corner that he has 3.7 million stellar jades and 420 oneric shards so we can round up to somewhere in the range of 4 million stellar jades if we put that into math and we do we know that a pack of stellar jades contains 8080 in total and they're worth around the range of a hundred dollars if we take his four million which is just a a rough estimate of how much he spent and we divide that by 880 he bought this pack four thousand nine hundred and fifty Times. By the way, I don't even think we talk about enough the time sink that would take of having to click the button 4,900 times. That in itself is a huge time loss, not to mention obviously the money loss. I genuinely think just sitting here and clicking this button almost 5,000 times, that's like a full day's work almost. That aside, if we take 5,000, which is a roundup, and we times that by 100, which is the cost of a Stellar Jade pack in USD, we get the number 500,000. $500,000 spent on a on a singular Fei Zhao banner. Absurd amounts of money, more than should have ever been spent. I'm sure if you were to calculate and add up all money spent between all of these individual videos, it would probably come somewhere in the range of $2 million. This is an absurd amount of money and a lot of people took to i don't want to say making fun but just saying things like oh you know you can spend money better you should not be doing this what is bro doing you can see some comments under the post to the degree of they are basically funding all of hoyoverse at this point why waste money like that not to sound mean or anything but the amount of money this person had spent on stupid stuff could have probably been donated instead and helped a lot of people. One-tenth of this gone to charity would have done a lot more for some people. This is literally throwing money down the drain. And that is kind of the reception that this tweet got. The EN community does not support this kind of thing. My general opinion on this and on whales in general is that there's two types of whales. There's dumb whales and smart whales. Dumb whales are people who don't have the money and spend it anyways. Smart whales are people who have the money and choose to spend it how they like my assessment of this person is well inaccurate because i don't have enough information to assess maybe they're taking out credit card loans and they're in huge amounts of debt 
or they're just super rich. It could be either or. But regardless, after all of the backlash that they got, they put out a final word on the 200 pull, 100 pull series that they've been doing. Sweet Tilly, who is a YouTuber, I believe, shed some light on this post, which shared some more insight into the translations that the user Adore Fuse, who is the maker of the 100 pull series, she translated some of the posts for him. First off, the Fuse part of their ID is actually a tribute to one of their friends who passed away. And that's going to be kind of a big part of why they're doing all this. They go on to say the E6 S100 plus series is their way of memorializing one of their friends who is passionate about anime and gaming. You can see this in a lot of their posts. It's actually really sad stuff and I'm not going to read it all. But he's done huge, long paragraph essays about um, how much he misses his friend. It's actually really sad stuff. And um, I don't have the fortitude to read through all of this. But if you want to, it is all on Billy Billy. And you can translate it um, and read this for yourself. But it is really sad stuff. And in actuality, this whole series is something that I would classify as sad. It's somebody who had a very distorted view on memorializing and mourning and was basically able to push this distorted view on memorializing through gotcha. They posted an update that said, now that enough people know about my friend, I will be ending the series completely. This may be the most irrational thing I, a self-considered rational person, has ever done. When I feel better, I will write about him and make donations in his name, even though I've already done so in the past, which I think is what everybody wanted. If you have the money, use it to donate. In a translated post here, which someone from Twitter translated, which I cannot speak to with this accuracy, they say that I always don't think it's necessary to say that I keep the game running. We are just playing a game. It's not that if I don't play HSR anymore, the game will die. This game HSR support all the players, included me. I think what this post is trying to get at is he's not only memorializing his friend through his actions, but also supporting a game which he dearly attributes to his friend. The last part and the last thing I'll read, which is another post translated by Sweet Tilly. She quoted from one of the Billy Billy posts here saying, I used to pull for other dupes in games like FGO, but after losing my friend, my distorted thinking and inability to cope with the reality led to me engaging in similar behavior on a much larger scale. Even though money is not an issue for me, this type of behavior is 100% not to be encouraged. And that's it. No more 100 pulls, no more 200 pulls. We will not be watching those anymore. I think that also puts to rest my theory that this person wasn't financially stable. They at least claim they are, which to me is good enough. If you're making enough money in life to spend $2 million on Star Rail, then hey, more power to you. You know what I mean? But regardless, I think that's going to be the end of our video for today. Let me know what you think of this whole situation in the comments below. But regardless, boys, that's going to be all from me. And I'm going to see you all in the next one. Peace.